hello guys and welcome back to i'm now tech in today's video as you can see we have this desktop here and the model number is for this two is primo e7936 so anytime when we power the pc on there's no power on the board and so as you can see we have the power cable plugged here and when we press the power button nothing shows on the board so it doesn't power on so let's get started and i'll show you how to solve this issue now as you can see we have the power pack here i've tested the power pack the power pack externally and it's working normal remove the ram checked within the motherboard and everything is working perfectly one thing i didn't take notice of was the cmos battery so i decided to replace the cmos battery but before we do that let's unplug the power cable then plug it power power on the piece again for you to see what exactly the problem is so let's plug in the power cable and then power on to see what how it's the pc is behaving so as we plug the power cable now we press the switch and you can see there's no power coming onto the board we have i've checked on the switch and this is the switch and it's perfectly perfect so we remove the power cable and then and replace the cmos battery so this is just a cmos battery so we remove that i removed it and checked and there was no power on the cmos battery so i decided to replace it with a new functioning one and this is just a new one so we insert that and then plug back the power cable now let's try with the power on to see if it will work or not so let's press on the switch right and as you can see the pc is just up and running and this you can see there was no light but now there is light and on the display as you can see it has displayed so that is just it the problem with it is from the cmos battery so we just replace that with the new one and this error message because we have replaced the cmos battery as a new one we have to set we have to do some configuration set up the date in order for it to for the pc to boot direct so guys that is just how easy and simple it is to solve this issue so if your pc is not powering up or if your fujitsu esprimo e7 nitrate is not powering up just try with this if you have tested with a different power pack and it's still not working just try this solution out it's going to work so guys as you can see i've just taken out the power cable drain the power and plug back the power cable and indeed as you can see it is working normal so you just got to replace the cmos battery and that is just how easy it is so if this video was helpful kindly leave us a like and don't forget to subscribe so we see you on our next video peace out